Hi, my name is Dan from Discord Fire Supplies, and today we'll be talking about replacing batteries on the Zero Plus wireless alarm system. The panel constantly monitors the devices for the battery levels. Uh, once the panel indicates a battery low fault, it means you've got roughly 60 days to replace the battery, and ideally it should be done within the 30 days. If the panel reports a battery fault, that means it's gone too far and they should be replaced immediately. Now to do so, simply remove the detector from its base. Inside you'll find two screws. Simply remove those and you'll be able to pull the back plate off. Uh, once you're inside, you will find the one pack of battery. Uh, detectors on their own with no sounders or strobes will only have one pack inside. Uh, manual call points will also have one battery pack. Any detector with a sounder or a sounder strobe will have two packs of batteries inside and a sounder strobe on their own will have three packs of batteries inside. Simply remove the battery and fit the new ones. Once that's done you're able to screw on the back plate and the battery's changed. Uh, the panel will reset once you tell it to uh, but the main thing to remember is that you need to reset the battery stats because the panel is constantly monitoring and needs to know that they have been replaced to get accurate readings again. To do the battery start reset, take the device in your hand. You need to press the front button and the rear tamper button together. Once that is done, remove the jumper link for the battery's bat uh, battery. Hold those two buttons down and place the link to the on position. Keep holding those buttons down. After a couple of seconds, you will get a set of beeps. Keep holding the, bat, uh, the buttons down for a further 10 seconds until you hear that chime. You can then release the buttons. This has now sent a signal to the panel that the batteries have been reset and is now monitoring as fresh. Uh, do that for all the devices. Uh, the only difference are on the standalone sort of sounders, manual core points and input output units, you obviously don't have a front button. So inside you've just got the tamper removal. So all you need to do is press the tamper removal button. Same process again, jump the link to on. After the 10 seconds, when you have these chime release, that has reset that unit then. And, you know, reset the panel and it's all back to normal. Uh, any more questions, please get in touch with Discount Fire Supplies. Thank you.